only. It's shot. I know. It's fun, though. That's part of the blast, right? Part of the excitement. Back live on the YouTube. Let's see what we got on the Instagram. We're having issues. We might need to reboot the phone again. Frustrating stuff. Welcome back, YouTubers. <clears throat> Happy Friday. Looks like we got our first order in. Robbie Fisher. No? Oh, it's for breaks. That's two spots, right? <clears throat> nice. It's happening on YouTube. What is happening? All right. We are live. <clears throat> Fantasy's been so good, Dickon. Seriously, it has been really good. These two cases of basketball have been super solid. <clears throat> Just a tad bit better. Just a tad bit better than Super Break. Just a little. Welcome back, Instagram. Late lunch is over. <clears throat> It's chicken noodle soup for lunch because I ate too much for breakfast today. In any case, anybody cares. Kyle's back. Interwood minis. Might be time for you to break, Kyle. Might be time. Another day. Pulled the big gold a couple days ago. Some good basketball left. <clears throat> Today was pretty much about the ice boxes. I definitely understand that. And boy, was it fun. What's up, Rocky? <clears throat> you need to talk yourself into fantasy basketball. Fantasy boxes. We have three left, John. Three left. They are 260 a box, as you can see right there. We have Don Rush Choice. We have a few different boxes available. Fantasy Sports, like I said, 260 a box, ripped and shipped, taxes included. What's up, Doug? How are you, man? You want to redeem yourself today with a new uh, Don Rush Choice box? I think you need I think you need one for redemption from yesterday. Officially down to three fantasy sports boxes. We only have five brothers and cards gold basketball boxes left, two brothers and cards football gold boxes, and four brothers and cards baseball. Down to single digits on everything when it comes to brothers and card gold boxes. $90 ripped and shipped. I thought you did, Doug. Was it two days ago? I'm getting my days mixed up now. I swear you bought one. I think it was maybe two days ago. What's up, Hustle Man? 
Wednesday. Wednesday. That's right. My bad. You're right. Took a day off. Now it's time to break another one, right? <clears throat> Just messing with you. Happy Friday afternoon. Uh, I have optic hobby boxes, John. I do. They're uh, four fifteen ripped and shipped, taxes included. Uh, no select left at all. Sold out of regular select, and I sold out of the hobby hybrid select. No worries, hustle man. I'm gonna be on for a little while, so you take your work call. Come back on. Yeah, blanket card collector did right. You've been watching some of the live from earlier with the ice boxes. That was pretty fun. Couldn't believe it took till like the fourth to last box to pull the Lucas Silver 10. Because there's 10 boxes. There's 10 boxes that were uh, shipped out, that were shipping out un unopened today. And the 10 boxes that are being shipped out have two, two case hits still in them. There's an Anthony Davis Prism Rookie PSA 10 and a Zion Rookie Prism PSA 10 still sitting in those 10 boxes. So two people are going to be really happy with their results. I mean, they're gonna, there's going to be multiple people happy because there were several other good hits that hadn't been pulled yet. What's up, Coach Du Bois? Thanks, man. I try to put a lot of effort into those ice boxes to make sure that people are happy even with the bad boxes. You know what I mean? We don't run the Brothers and Cards program. We are friends with all the Brothers and Cards people, and we consider them very close personal friends. We are business business uh, vendors for them. Hey, Rips Cards. If you've ever checked out Rips Cards Instagram, man, you talk about heat, of card heat. That's Rips Cards. <laughs> You are not seeing double, Addison. You are not seeing double. What happened to YouTube, Doug? Yeah, do not bring up that other name, Todd. Do not. Yeah, no, they're, gr they're great. I mean, their whole program is supposed to be a subscription-based program, Funky Colds Wax. That is what you really want to do. I mean, we're, we love the business, obviously. We love ripping for them, ripping boxes. But the main thing that they really try to accomplish is their subscription because you guys want to sign up for a monthly subscription with Brothers and Cards. You know, you definitely want to utilize them because it's cheaper, number one, to buy the monthly subscription. And number two, you know, you're getting consistent product every single month. And I swear, they have so many good products that come out that they add to their program every month in every sport. I would, uh, I'm one of the biggest apologists for Brothers and Cards. You'll hear me cheering for them every time we talk about their program. And couldn't have better guys running that operation as well. And then there's Andy Dickin. I mean, he just kind of gets thrown in the mix. <laughs> So we have an open queue. If anybody would be interested in busting anything right now. Open queue. It's open mic season. The MVP of the BIC. And it's because the owner can't give himself the MVP. It's not allowed. I could never give myself the, the MVP. What's up, Xavier? Terrence? Swipe it a Fox and Nick Johnson, CWS cards. Oh, we're getting some people popping on the YouTube as well. Appreciate it. <clears throat> I was considered, I was compared to a coach card from Prism, Addison. That's how important I am. I was compared to a 1718 Prism coach card. What's up, JB? Uh, we are out of basketball blasters, man. Sold out of those a while ago. What's up, Spencer? Fantasy Sports is right here, Nelson. Right there, 260 a box. 
We have three boxes available, and that's it. And then we're sold out completely. Fantasy Sports is a great product. If you can't open ice boxes for two and a quarter, there's my card, Dad. I miss you, Dave. Dave, did you get to see the uh, ice boxes get open today? It was fantastic. And we sold out in 12 minutes, Dave. I don't know if you saw that and heard that, too. From 11, we went live. 11, 12 is when the last box sold on our website. I couldn't believe it. So, Nelson, I'll tell you real quick what it consists of. They're great boxes. Each box has two cards inside, two single cards that are buyback cards. Hey, Alex. Thanks for joining back on, buddy. Each box has two graded, not graded, two buyback cards. Some are graded, some are ungraded. Those are random. And then also two unopened packs of random product. Uh, I've seen some crazy good stuff come out of the unopened packs. Uh, there's there's just a lot of good stuff that comes out of fantasy. We are big fans of fantasy sports. Um, probably, I'm not going to be biased and say mine, but besides mine, one of our favorites, it's probably one of the best quality return on investment products that exists out there as well. We really like them a lot. It's 260 a box, completely ripped and shipped, taxes included. Uh, sports uh, for JB, Sport Brothers and Cards have basketball, football, and baseball, JB. $90 a box, ripped and shipped, taxes included for us. Um, they have basketball, football, and baseball. All very good products. Uh, the product that we run, it's called the Icebox, and we listed it for sale this morning at 11 a.m. I only do a run of about 50 to 75 boxes at a time. Takes a lot of time, pretty uh, pretty hard effort. Hey, Gunner. Andy Exotic, not Exotic Andy. Exotic Andy sounds like I work for something else. Andy Exotic means I'm a big Tiger fan like Joe Exotic. <laughs> anyway, back to Nelson. Uh, the ice boxes. If you go back and watch our Instagrams from this morning, uh, this early this afternoon, or our YouTubes from the, this afternoon, you will see what comes out of those ice boxes. It was pretty fun, man. Absolute, absolute blast. But I, like I said, Fantasy Sports is a great product. I highly recommend them. I was just called Exotic Andy. That's kind of scary. Gunner, did you see the picture? Did you see the picture that my wife took of me? She had this like Google thing that she could do. I thought it was pretty funny. Check this out. She took this of me yesterday. She was able to get it on YouTube or on Google, I mean. That'd be me. Hanging out with my big tigers in my living room. <laughs> oh, shoot. That's funny. John sent an order for Optic. All right. Let's check it out. John's breaking the ice on the uh, post-lunch break breaks. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Nice. Thank you, John Bridges. We're doing two boxes. I love it. Let's pull some heat for Mr. Bridges. <clears throat> All right. John, you have to give me numbers. I need two numbers, one through seven, John. Two numbers, one through seven. Kyle, I hope you don't regret this. Good luck to John. One through seven. Flying Hawaiian, welcome back. Number one and number seven. There's number one. There's number seven. Hey, Jake. Jacob, Jeff's calling me. Can you call him back on your phone? Thank you. <clears throat> All right. Box one for John. Good luck to you, my friend. <clears throat> Let's 
pull a, uh, it's been a long time since we've seen green or a one of one. Box one. Mufiandu Kabangeli, Joe Harris, CJ McCollum. We're doing well, man. We're doing well. Are you actually in Hawaii, flying Hawaiian? All right. Admiral Schofield, Mish Smith, Eric Bledsoe Hollow, and Otto Porter. KPJ, Blake Griffin, De'Aaron Fox, and Kelly Olenek. Isaiah Roby, we've got a lime green in here. Gerald Green, Gerald Lime Green. A rated rookie. I haven't seen one of those in a while. Iggy Brasdakis, numbered out of 149. Oh, you got the nickname from your neighbor? That's pretty funny. That's great. All right, Nikhil Alexander Walker, DeMar DeRozan, and Aaron Gordon Silver all clear for takeoff. In Wisconsin, you couldn't be polar opposite of Hawaii then, could you? That's pretty funny. Terry Rozier, Carson Edwards, LaMarcus Aldridge. Oh, B. 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 Oh. <laughs> I hope Chad's not watching. He'll laugh at me. That was a hollow Pelicans in the bottom right corner. Nikilo Melli. Wah, wah. Sorry, John. K Knox, Tremont Waters, Jordan Clarkson, and J Joker. I know, right? Out, Kyle. Whew. Thought I paid for a couple boxes and then some. Quendary Weatherspoon, Jeremy Lamb, and Russell Westbrook. But there's a lot of boxes, a lot of packs left. A lot of packs left, John. Don't lose hope. There's a hollow right there. Ty Jerome, Devin Booker, Derek Rose. Nasir Little, Andrew Wiggins, all clear for takeoff. Giannis Vucevic. There's an orange. Orange is pretty low numbered. Alex Len, Cameron Johnson, Rudy Gay. Oh, another rated rookie color. Just the wrong players, John. Talon Horton Tucker, numbered out of 199. <clears throat> I do kind of like the vibe that we're getting out of these boxes here because it's a lot of rated rookie stuff in color and base. So that means there's a Steph Curry stargazing. That means we have a chance of getting something decent. All right. Kobe White, Hassan Whiteside, Justin Holiday, and Fred Van Vliet. Hollow. The Van Vliet's a hollow. <clears throat> Uh, Gunner, there's a guy named Zion Williamson. There's a nice All-Stars Hollow KD. When you pull a Pelican and you see a Hollow, and you slow roll it from the corner. Oh, my word. Why is it so hard to open? You're hoping it's the big dog. Toby Harris, Tyler Hero, Steven Adams, Paul Pierce Rainmakers. What's up, Sports Card Razor? <clears throat> BBN, Daddy MB. Another, we got a red. How about a rated rookie red? Daniel Gafford, McCall Bridges, number 299. McCall Bridges, red. Alex is calling Zion and Job Base in these next two packs. I hope you're right. There's our auto. It's not good. Chuma Okeke. Chuma, on card rated rookie auto. Yeesh. Come on, John. You are due for a good one out of here. Let's go. There it is. You were freaking right, Kyle. That's amazing. How did you know? How did you know? There's a jaw base right there, which means we're probably going to hit a Zion in the next pack. These things run synonymous with each other. Man, Kyle Nostradamus going on right now. Predicting the future. Nice, John. <laughs> get out of here come on he has watched 
he has watched way too many boxes get opened. There's a Daniel Gafford hollow from the same bo same pack. You got yourself a jaw base and a Zion base. That is never a bad thing, John. That is so crazy. Same exact run. He's, ooh, there's a pink velocity in here. Be good. Come on. Cam Reddish. It's not a rated rookie. Ah. Miles Turner. That's numbered out of 79. Um, let's see. Let me look, John. I would say top to bottom is about 60-40, 65-35. Left to right, it's 50-50. I'd give it a shot. It's definitely top to bottom. You can see if I move it around for you, top to bottom is an issue. <clears throat> well, Kyle was right. John Zion helps a lot when you open a box that doesn't have any good color. Yeah, I know. Right card, wrong player. That saying is said way too many times in our card shop, right? <clears throat> Never heard of her. Who's that Zion person? All right, John. Box two. Good luck, man. Empty box. Box two. Bring me some good stuff. Isaiah Roby, DeAndre Jordan, Dirk Nowitzki, really off-centered. Nasty. Hassan Whiteside. <clears throat> All this talking these last three days, I swear my voice is about to go. Are we going to get another John Zion, Kyle? Nikhil, Damar. Ooh. Ooh. Look at this one, John. Rainmakers. Red. Numbered out of 99, Kobe Bryant. That is awesome. That is a really cool insert right there. Rainmakers Red, Kobe out of 99. Good pull. Seriously, we're not going to get him, Kyle, after just looking at those two packs being open? That's not what I want to hear, but that's a good insert right there. Rainmaker Red, John. Congratulations, man. It's got to have a little value. Probably gradable. Okay, Carson Edwards, Lamarcus, DeRozan, and K Knox. I think I remember pulling those before. I think you're wrong, guy, Kyle. I think you're wrong, Kyle. Bobble, Zaya Thomas, Shea Gilgis, Hollow. You're a Kentucky fan. There's a nice card for you, John. Hollow, Shea Gilgis in his Thunder Uni. <clears throat> P.J. Washington, Damari Carroll, Andrew Wiggins, and Eric Gordon. Kyle says a big fat nope. Nasir Little, Andrew Wiggins, Terrence Mann, hollow rookie. All right. Perfectly centered. Why couldn't they do that with your Zion base, right? That would have been nice. Cam Reddish. Reggie Jackson, all clear for takeoff. Westbrook and a Clay Thompson. Ooh, a hero black. That'd be sweet. There's an orange. Maybe I can get you a hero orange. How's that? Toby Harris, Caban Gale. Or how about an Evan Fournier who has a really bad receding hairline going on for age 27? Not good. All right. Insert Schofield, Smith, Lillard, and Len. That'd be so cool to hit a black velocity. There's a hollow. Gobert, KPJ, Griffin, Jabari Parker. This is another guy I really swung and missed on. I invested pretty heavily in Jabari Parker. DeLon Wright, Justin Holiday, Darius Garland, and a LeBron James Silver all clear for takeoff. If you're not getting rookies, you are getting all the other stuff. Look at that. LeBron all clear for takeoff. Pretty cool, man. It's awesome. Sorry, YouTube. I keep going up too high because I'm trying. John's on Instagram, so I'm trying to show him what he gets. So you've got a Kobe to 99 and LeBron all clear for takeoff hollow. Very cool. 
Very, very cool. Here we go. There's another hollow back here. Zach Levine, Miles Turner, Tremont Waters, John Wall. Another Kentucky guy. Uh-oh, Kyle says there's hope. I hope there's hope. John Collins, Jordan Clarkson, Weatherspoon, and Ish Smith. Is Smith more like Turd Ferguson? Uh oh, I think we've got a hollow auto coming up, John. Boyan, Jeremy Lamb, Jordan Bone. You just got Jordan Boned. <laughs> Yuck ish. All right, Ty Jerome, D Book, Clay, and Chris Stapps. Turd Ferguson. Hi, Bob. Ooh, we got a pink velo. I'd take that for Tyler Hero, right? Kemba. Deontay. Hey! Kyle was wrong. A base Zion back to back boxes. <laughs> well said, Fox Breaks. Come on, one time. Oh, that's good. Look at those back-to-back -back cards. A Giannis Pink Velocity, 42 of 79, and a Base Zion. Same pack. That a boy, John. Now we're talking. That Giannis is beautiful, too. Zion's the exact same centering as the first one. Perfect left to right, probably 65-35, top to bottom. That was a good pack. So is John ja Morant right after this? Kyle. This is a great vet box. John ja Morant. There's a Tyler Hero base. Kyle. Yeah, there's five, there's five boxes left in this case. This has been a really good case. Derek Favors, Steven Adams, Cam Johnson, Malcolm Brogdon Hollow. Two packs left. Yeah, we heard Thomas, unfortunately. I mean, it's actually, I, we think it's fortunate because it's going to be so hard to deal with um, Bowman when we do such a big celebration of Bowman baseball in our shop. If we can't be open to even having business in, I'd rather it be pushed back so we can at least have a decent uh, flow coming through. Willie Colley, Schroeder, Kobe White, and it's a rated rookie. Taylor Horton Tucker again, red man. Guys, this is a momentous occasion because I think this is the first box of optic I have seen that didn't have a jaw Morant to go with a Zion or a Zion to go with a jaw. Kyle, what say you? I'm nervous, Kyle. What is going on in this world? We did not get a jaw to go with a Zion. I'm nervous. That was a good box, though, John. That, I mean, you did pretty well for two boxes. The, the pack that had the Zion base and the Giannis pink velocity was solid. Yeah, a bunch of stuff's going to get pushed back for sure. Steel City posted 529 as the next Bowman release date. Tops just said TBD, man. They did? Well, I guess if you're going to say 529, that's TBD. It's as late as it can get. Yeah, that was crazy, huh? Crazy, crazy. Yeah, that box is how they should be. A little split up, right? Trying to save some love. Yes, sir, John. 260 to PayPal for a fantasy box, I assume. IndieCardExchange at gmail.com. If anybody wants to put that out there, I'll uh, pin it. Thank you for buying those boxes too, John. Really appreciate it. Thank you, Thomas.
IndyCardExchange at gmail.com. I'll get you rolling. Got a cue? Thank you, Jude. The real Jude Anthony. John said 260. All right, John. You ready for a fantasy box? Yes, Hustle Man. We have football blasters. 35 a box, ripped and shipped. Prism football blasters. <laughs> it's pretty funny, John. John, give me a number one through three, man. We got three boxes of this left. Box one is the display box, and then we've got two more behind me. Number one through three. <clears throat> Open two out there. Yep. Okay. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oops. Yes. Oh, because of the. Just let it run this time. That was. I'll make sure he knows. All right, number one, Devin Booker. Good call. I watched the uh, Kentucky Wisconsin highlight game last night. I was on CBS Sports. Booker. It's so funny because Booker was kind of just a – he was good, but he wasn't like he is in the NBA, obviously. It's a beefy box, John. It's a very beefy box. Good luck to you, McFinn. Go get him. Oh, yeah. Wow. What in the heck is in here? That is a big, I'm guessing it's like a really big fat pack, maybe like a Donruss basketball or something. Because this is one of the thickest packs I have ever seen. Huh. What? Wait a second. That's, is that football? Panini black gold? Is that a basketball product? It is NBA. Wait a second. I'm so confused. Did they do black gold in basketball? And I just forgot about it. I, I I'm baffled, but whatever it is, it's a cool pack and it's got high end stuff in it. I wish it was NT Ben. Whew. Yeah, he couldn't, man. It was crazy. I know, guys. I'm so confused on this right now. All right. We're gonna see what the cards are first and then get into these interesting packs. There is a Elvin Hayes, all-time greats, immaculate auto. Hey, how about this for a Kentucky fan? Rookie ticket, De'Aaron Fox from Contenders. That's the variation rookie ticket. Very cool. We do have basketball gold boxes, Carson. They're not on the website. They're on our live break page. So you go to our Instagram, and you will see break live stuff for rip and ship and we are ripping brothers and cards gold boxes basketball baseball and football jonathan isaac that was your 1718 don rust pack so yeah john look at that you got that as one of your bonus hits and then we're going to go to this beast because i am right now currently baffled 2016 black gold basketball Do you remember this jake 2016 black gold basketball yeah. I don't. I really don't. Is it collegiate? Okay, Doug says collegiate black gold. It is collegiate. You're right. Oklahoma. There's the first hit. It's all jacked up. Buddy Heald. It is a little gold piece with an Oklahoma logo on it. Buddy Heald. There is a autograph on card of Henry Ellenson, 11 of 99. See, so if you're going to get anything, you might as well get some UK hits, right? There are five cards in here, actually. And a Duke hit. Jaleel Okafor, Shadow Box Swatch. Collegiate Black Gold. That's what this is. Thank you, Doug, for the clarification. John says he opened a case of it back in the day. University of Kansas. Gunner's going to be excited. A rated rookie medal card of Wayne Selden, Jr., all right, time for something good. Come on now. 35 of 75. Alfred Payton. 
Hmm. Interesting. 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 Got really excited about that. Super confused. Collegiate black gold. You never know what you're going to get in fantasy basketball. That's for sure. Thank you, John. Garbage, he says. Taking it dry. Carson, you uh, paid at IndyCardExchange at gmail.com on PayPal. And we will break that box live. John, you have the floor right now if you'd like anything else. It was an interesting box, to say the least, from Fantasy. we got a hustle man that just sent some money. We have uh, two Fantasy boxes left. That's correct. Check out the pinned post, Carson. It looks like... Uh, all right, John's up for one more fantasy. He gets the tro he gets the table. So John, pick number one or two and send me the two sixty through, and we'll go with it. Hustle man, you are in the queue for your blasters for sure. John's got the table. Box number one. We're going with Devin Booker again, right here. Go ahead and send that through, John. And our final box of fantasy will sit right back here behind. Thank you, thank you, John. Spencer, which one's you asking for? Fantasy, they're two sixty a box. John is getting ready to open this one right here. And behind that is one box left. <clears throat> I keep clearing my throat, guys, because I am – my voice is shot. It's kind of crazy. All right. Let me know when that comes through, John. All right, we got it. We got it. Let's do it. Another brother, another fantasy sports box for Mr. Bridges. Let's go, John. Good luck to you. Let's hit some fire, says Spencer. That's right. I'm ready for some fire. Okay, much thinner pack right there. There is a graded card in here, John. Fantasy sort basketball. There's an optic hobby pack in the front. And a Panini season update. Steph Curry's rookie year season update in the back. That tells me there might be something decent right in between. First hit is... That is a great start right there. A blue press proof. LeBron James from Don Russ, numbered out of 49. It's a solid, solid hit. Number 27 of 49. LeBron James, low numbered in, uh, parallel. Nice hit, bud. That is a really good hit. LeBron James in the next hit. All right, Jordan insert. Now we're talking. Not a big one, probably a $25 card, but the Enfuego 9697 Tops Chrome BGS9. BGS9 Enfuego insert of MJ. We got the goat and the baby goat in the same box. I could hear them neighing. The goat, just for clarification, the goat on the front and the baby goat. Number two. I've talked a lot, Kevin. Jake was making fun of me earlier and says I talk too much. So I guess I self-induced. The goat and the baby goat. Congratulations, John. Let's open these packs up. He is a baby goat. Okay, Spencer Hawes, LeBron, the baby goat, James. 
Taj Gibson. We're looking literally for Steph Curry out of here. If you get a Steph Curry, then you hit the lottery. Go buy a lottery ticket. He didn't. Don't go buy a lottery ticket. Okay, pack of Optic Hobby. This is your bonus pack of Optic Hobby. You didn't even know you were getting it. DeLon Wright, Bruno Fernando, Thomas Bryant, and Ben Simmons stargazing. That's a good box right there. I mean, I no clue how much that's worth, but a numbered LeBron out of 49, very good. <clears throat> yeah, Studio Collector. A lot of people that are under the age of 30 would disagree with me. But the rest of the world would say, he's right. Okay, John. The table is yours if you want the last fantasy box. If not, we're going to move on to the next person in the queue. Did you, did you do it or you want me to check it? Okay, I got it. Thank you too, man. I really appreciate it. You take care as well. All right. Todd, you are up, my friend. You've got uh, two Prism Blasters. And then I saw you sent 180 as well. Let me check and see what that's for, my friend. A Brothers in Cards Gold, football and basketball. Very cool. All right, Todd. So we got these two boxes here. Actually, I'll let you pick if you want. I got three of them left. One, two, or three. You pick two of the three. And then, Todd, you're going to give me a uh, – <clears throat> you're going to give me a – Number one through four for basketball and one or two on football when it comes to brothers and cards. I'm sorry, one through five on basketball. <clears throat> Later, Gunner. If you want it, go hit it in the queue, Andy. If you want it, <clears throat> nobody else has ponied up the money for it yet. Last blue LeBron at 55 bucks. Man, I think that would be worth more. Low numbered LeBrons usually sell more than that. It must have to be prism or optic for it to go high. It's not bad. I agree. All right. What do you say, Todd? <clears throat> need number. I need two numbers out of here, one through three. For your brothers and cards boxes, I need one through five and number one or two. It's a lot of math. I apologize. If it's prism or optic, it's way more than 100 out of 49. I would think it's going to go for more than that, unless it's just the high-grade stuff that sells for stupid money. <clears throat> Chris Rossetti, we're doing personal box breaks on uh, our Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter pages. You have to buy, send PayPal, and notate what you are buying. All right, Todd, are you there? It's true. That's still pretty strong from February 29th. That's very true. <clears throat> <laughs> all right brothers and cards andy just bought our last box of fantasy basketball thank you sir i think we lost todd for a minute i gotta wait make sure he is on because we need to rip his boxes first LeBron blue jersey number for a thousand bucks, huh? Shoo wee. Yeah, we have grading card sleeves for sale. They're called graded team bags. I hope it comes true for you as well, Mr. Dickin. Blue laser optics a lot different than a base blue Don Russ. <clears throat> there he is. He's back. We thought we lost you. I know you're in New York City, so you had me holding my breath for a second, man. You are up, Todd. You are up. We're waiting for you. You've got to pick number one, two, or three. You get two of the three choices out of this. 
give me numbers one through five for basketball and give me number one or two on football and we'll rip it all for you because you are up. Then we've got Carson behind you and then we've got Andy Dickin behind him. You got to stop working so hard, Todd. You're here to have fun. Let us let us rip cards for you. <laughs> this is quarantine time. Can't work during quarantine. Just kidding. Two and three. All right. The ones that I picked originally for you. Okay. Give me number one through five on your Brothers and Cards basketball. That's right. Brock's calling for a Kyler Silver. One through five. And for bat football, it's number one or two. That's it. Basketball number five. All right. There's your basketball number five. Football. We are sold out of hybrid card stash. Football number one or two. Football two. All right. There we go. Put these in the background. And we will rip away. Here we go, Hustle Man. Thank you so much again for all the business and support. You have been fun to hang out with and make fun of me the last two days, which I will take gladly because I know it's all in good fun. Okay, good luck. You just really have to stop working so hard, Hustle Man. First pack of Prism is a Peyton Manning. Gold laser for the Colts. Darius Geis, Naheem Hines, John Urshua for the Seahawks. Gold laser rookie. It's going to be tough to pop those last two Prism uh, blaster boxes that our boy uh, FNM hit. There's a Mahomes emergent and a Jonathan Abram rookie. Guy Aaron opened two boxes of Prism Blasters and pulled like every good hit you could hit. Tyler Eifert, Mariota, Dante Pettis, Clay Matthews. Where'd Clay Matthews go, guys? I know he got dropped by the Rams. Did he get picked up yet? Amari Cooper, Jamal Williams. There's a silver Steve Largent and an Akeel Harry. The hustle man never stops. That's right, Dickon. There is a rookie, Ty Johnson, Derek Barnett, Cam Newton. And our jersey card is Paris Campbell of the Indianapolis Colts. He's a free agent. Thanks, Brian. That was not the box we were hoping for right there, Todd. Let's pull a better one in box number two for you. Oop. Box two, Prison Blaster. Or hustle man. Hustle man. How many times I heard that in my junior high, high school, and college years? Hustle man. Hustle. From my dad. Come on, Andy. Hustle. Heinz Ward, gold laser. Juju, Kyle Fuller, Nick Vanette, Irv Smith Jr., gold laser rookie. Deion Lewis, Harrison Butker, Joe Namath, and Lil Jordan Humphrey. Lil Jordan. It's Lil John, not Little John. Another gold laser coming up. Deshaun Jackson, Clinton Portis, Kiko Alonzo. He was an Oregon Duck linebacker. He was a beast at Oregon. Yeah, it was two really good boxes, Brian. We got a silver again, Ted Ginn Jr. and Julian Love. He's a domer. Go Irish. Yeah, there was a Daniel Jones base, a Drew Locke base, a Jarrett Stidham gold laser, a jersey card of Jarrett Stidham, all from two boxes. Lamar Miller, Terry Bradshaw, Ken Jennings, I mean Gary Jennings Jr., and Alex Barnes. 
Lil Jordan. All right, time to redeem yourself with some good brothers and cards boxes. We'll stay on the football train. Keep football going. Fantasy basketball, Dirk. I'm assuming when you say b-ball, basketball, or baseball. Basketball, there are four boxes left. Baseball, there are four boxes left. Football is down to one box. Our packs, 40 brothers and cards football box. Playoff one, legacy three, elite four, an optic hobby one. Some value right there. All right, on to the playoff. I know, it was crazy, Brian. I couldn't believe it. Here we go. Jarvis Landry, Howie Long, Troy Eggman, DJ Moore, Marquise Goodwin, a thunder and lightning of Big Ben and Juju. Here is a Air Command Drew Lock rookie. Air Command Drew Lock, not a bad hit. And Deontay Thompson. On to the Legacy Packs. Seriously, I couldn't believe he hit all that stuff. There's a Drew Lock sitting right on the back. Larry Fitzgerald, Marcus Peters, Saquon, Philip Lindsay, Roger Craig, Philip Lindsay again. Nikhil Harry and Drew Locke. I'm trying to help you guys keep your sanity. I just need to keep my voice. I got weeks of this kind of stuff ahead because I don't think we're going to be able to be open for a while. Sterling Sharp. There's a numbered Andy Isabella, Jake's favorite player. Jake jinxes everybody when it comes to football breaks. When you think you're going to pull a Kyler, it becomes an Andy and Isabella inside the pack. It changes from a Kyler to an Isabella. There's a Chrome card in here there, Hustle Man. And it is Josh Allen for the UK Wildcats. Not numbered. You got a Tremaine Edmonds out of 299, Cleland Farrell, and Terry McLaurin. Not much for the Legacy Packs or the Playoff Packs. But this is where the heat really is. Elite and Optic. Roquan Smith, Sammy Watkins, Baker Mayfield Spellbound, numbered out of 99. Tremaine Edmonds and Andrew Luck. The former Colt, Andrew Luck. I think they released this Elite product like right when Andrew decided to hang it up. Oh, we got an auto, I think. Let's get something good. Larry Fitzgerald, Sony Michelle. Philip Rivers, Xavier Howard, and Roquan Smith, stud linebacker for the Chicago Bears. Roquan Smith out of 99 autograph, back to the future. Good looking card, Todd. Roquan's a beast. He is a good linebacker for the Bears. Not a pen pal, but it was good. Roquan Smith. Philip Lindsay, Dak Prescott. We've got a Michael Thomas, purple parallel to 99. Michael Thomas. Brandon Cooks, 99. Michael Thomas, 51 of 99. Aaron Jones, Carson Wentz. If any of you know what I'm talking about, you're laughing right now. Go to the old YouTube. Found a scammer breaker that flipped out a good card for a Brandon Cooks out of 99. Bobby Wagner, Terry McLaurin, Ooh, stuck together. Jamal Adams is Terry McLaurin's the rookie on deck, not numbered. It's a good-looking card, though. Julio Jones and a filler. So you got an auto out of your elite. Pretty solid. Sounds good, Dirk. Go ahead and send payment for the fantasy basketball. We'll get you in the queue. A couple people behind you, or in front of you, I should say. Optic Football, Drew Brees, Baker Mayfield, Adam Thielen, and Gary Jennings Jr. So you got an auto out of Brothers and Cards Football Box. On to basketball for Hustle Man. Hustle Man, I think, got the exact same allocation as our last basketball box, but that yielded some really good hits. One, two, three, four, five, six hoops. One Optic Retail, one Prism Retail, and one Optic Hobby. Pretty solid, man. We'll hook you up. 
Let's go ahead and hit uh, IndyCardExchange at gmail.com and PayPal, Dirk. And notate that it's for fantasy basketball. Jabari Parker, McCall Bridges, Nasir Little, Rui, Weatherspoon, Blake Griffin. Two more base. We haven't opened much Revolution. We still have one, uh, four boxes total left of Revolution, Andrew. Four boxes left. Schroeder, Favors, Pascal, Reddish, Fernando. We got a high voltage insert. Jason Tatum. Like that. That's nice, Todd. You did take the last fantasy basketball. Did I say fantasy? I meant brothers and cards. I'm sorry, Andy. He's buying. I'm sorry, Dirk. I do not have any fantasy basketball. I apologize. I have brothers and cards basketball. Andy Dickin got the last fantasy basketball. If you sent me money, then I will refund you. I apologize. I, my brain's starting to get fried. I apologize, man. Andy Dickin bought the last fantasy basketball. I will refund you, Dirk. I sincerely apologize, man. That was not smart of me. There you go, Todd. A Zion Tribute Hoops. I saw the last Tribute Hoops of this in a PSA 10 sold for $115. And this is a really clean-looking one, too. Zion Tribute. Who would have thought? Dirk, I will definitely refund you, man. I'm so, unless you want it towards something else. Um, these are exactly the same price, the Donruss Choice, if you want it. If not, again, I apologize. For some reason in my head, when you said fantasy basketball, I had Brothers and Cards basketball in my head for 90 bucks. DeAndre Jordan, Danny Green, Patrick Beverly, Grant Williams, Cam Johnson, Clay Thompson, Lou Williams, and Tim Hardaway Jr., Markeef, Thomas Bryant, Anthony Davis, Jalen Hands, Keldon Johnson, Cat, Josh Richardson, and Langston Galloway. Last hoops pack, Todd. It is two in a row. Isn't that kind of weird, Jude? I'll take those, though. Getting a high voltage insert. Those are decent. Malik Monk. Ooh, what's this? That's a... What do they call these? Not hollow, but it is an insert, and it's the uh, it's a parallel of an insert. Let's put it that way. Action shots, LeBron James. Look at that, Todd. That's a sweet card. What do they call it? hollow or foil? Maybe foil. Does that sound right? Foil action shot. Optic retail. Coming right up for you, Todd. This has been a really good, really good box. Jalen Noel, Nick Batum, Giannis, and nice. Retail purple of DeAndre Hunter for you, Todd. Hustle Man's getting some hits. Hustle Man pulling off some basketball hits. That is awesome. Two packs left. We got our Prism Retail and our Optic Hobby left. Prism Retail. Here we go. No silvers in this one. Ben Simmons, Bruno Fernando, Carl Anthony Towns hyped, and MKG. <clears throat> Optic Hobby. There is not a hollow. Devin Booker, Eric Gordon, Vucevic, and Giannis Dominators. Really nice finish to that Brothers and Cards basketball box right there. Nice job, Todd. Thank you so much. I will check my messages, Aiden. We'll get everything for you, buddy. All right. Uh, I've got a refund Dirk here. Uh, let me do that real quick. Todd, let me know if you would like any more boxes before we move on. In the queue, I think, is Carson with a Brothers and Cards basketball. Can you refund somebody for me? Because I screwed up. I was confusing my fantasy and my... Um, Brothers and Cards boxes for some stupid reason. <clears throat> Dirk Willette sent 260. We need to refund him. Um, you have anything else from Matt, right? What? You have anything else from Matt? We can pick all that shipping stuff out. For mail? Yeah. Uh-uh. Yeah. Nope. Yeah. I agree. Brothers and Cards puts together a great product. 
Hustle Man, would you like any more Brothers in Cards boxes before we move on? All right. Thank you so much, my friend. Thank you. Thank you. It looks like Carson is up next. Carson, you have a number one through four for Brothers in Cards basketball. Give me a number one through four. Dirk, you should have your money refunded. Yes, Andrew, Jake is here. Guys, I'm going to log off and log back on Instagram because uh, we're about to go get timed out. So we will break Carson's box as soon as he gives me number three. Okay, I'll pull out number three, Carson, and then we will log off and log back on Instagram. Thank you. Whew. All right. Sorry, YouTube. Had to take another restroom break. I'm sure everybody loves hearing that. There we go. Feeling better. Feeling the flow. Working it. Working it. Welcome back, IG. Welcome back. Getting ready to break a box of Brothers and Cards basketball for Carson. Just finished a nice Brothers and Cards run for Hustle Man. He did really well. Very happy with his basketball boxes. <clears throat> Carson, let me know when you're on and ready to rock and roll, buddy. We are out of fantasy basketball now, Bay State Cards. We are fully out. We have a choice, though. We do have Donruss. Whoop! It's going to fall on me. We do have Donruss Choice. 260 a box. Thank you, Addison. You win. <clears throat> What's up, Gary Harris? From Fort Wayne, I think. All right, Carson. He is ready to go. I did see it. This is box three. I picked it. Box one was right here. Box two and three and four were back there. And I picked number three for you. Here we go. We're breaking a box of Brothers and Cards basketball. Looks like it's the... No, we got a different pack in here. All right. <clears throat> for Carson, we have... Hoops, one, two, three, four, five. Optic Retail, one. We've got a Black Friday pack, a Prism Retail, and an Optic Hobby. Good luck to Carson. 
Nice little diversity in that pack, right? Andrew Mark wanted to know if you were here, Jake. I think he misses you. DeAndre Hunter, Shaquille O'Neal. He says you're here. He and Matt are shipping their little tails off right now. Lillard. I get to have the fun today and break. Legends of the ball, Dwayne Wade. Boyan. <clears throat> Good luck, Carson. Let's hit something, buddy. Let's hit something. Josh Okogie, Millsap, DeAndre Hunter tribute. We got a hot rookie. No, we got a hot signatures. Not a rookie. That's the mayor, current basketball coach of the Nebraska Cornhuskers. The mayor, Fred Hoiberg. We got a uh, foil out of 199 of Will Barton, D'Angelo, and Wesley Matthews. <clears throat> Why is Fred Hoiberg in a product? Why, 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 why? I will never know. Josh Jackson, Lucas Simonich, Jonas Valanchunas. Road to the finals, Clay Thompson out of 2019. Kevin Love and Anthony Davis. Welcome back to everybody on Instagram. Thank you to everyone who's on YouTube watching this madness. Jordan Poole, Harrison Barnes, NBA City, Donovan Mitchell, Jokic, Krabby, and... Igadala. On to the Black Friday pack. How about an autograph out of here? Why not, right? Why not? Fernando Tatis Jr. It's not a bad card, even though this is supposed to be a basketball box. DeAndre Ayton. There are autographs and memorabilia that come out of these Black Friday packs a lot, so hopefully you guys hit one once in a while. Ben Simmons retail, Drew Holiday, D'Angelo Russell, and Casey Akpala. Prism retail. We need one good hit. <clears throat> oh, thank you, Jude. Uh, we do sell NASCAR. I think we just sold our last NASCAR box, though, two bros cards. Ooh, we got a green in here. There's a Bruce Brown, Alan Smilagalic, and... Damari Carroll Green. That was not the green we were looking for. Come on, Carson. Box three needs to be good for you. All it takes is one. There is a hollow in here. Be good. Cobbin Gale, Paul George, Harrison Barnes. It's a rated rookie. Cobbin Gale. What are the odds you pulled a Cobbin Gale base and a Cobbin Gale? Hollow in the same pack. Not the same box. The same pack. Not the greatest, Carson. Sorry, man. Would you like another before we move on? Hi, Addie Grace. I'll give you the old wave. I haven't done this today. I'll give everybody the wave that's on Instagram. There you go. You got it. <clears throat> that was for my... Little cousin who just joined. All right, Carson, we are going to do one. You want box number one, this one right here? All right, Carson's going to be right back. Send payment. <clears throat> Go ahead and send payment, and then we will break for you. All right, so we sent Dirk his money back. AT, what did you send money for? The soccer? I think it was. Yes. So Carson, Andy Dickon is next for his last, the fantasy box that's sitting up there. We refunded Dirk, and there's nobody else in the queue. So we're going to get some money coming from Carson. It's going to be box one, this one right here, the display box. We have two basketball, one football, and four baseball left. Put a new display box back here. Here we go. <clears throat> Hi, Fortner. 
We have a lot of Donruss Choices boxes left. We bought um, two more sealed cases from our distributor, Doug, because we know how good of a break box it is. From this case, there's the display box and six more back here in the case. So there's seven total boxes left, Doug. The guy that opened one earlier pulled an Iggy Brass Dacus next day auto. Wah, wah. <clears throat> Excuse me. Got your money, Carson. We are good to go. Doing another Brothers and Cards basketball box, gold box for Carson Lucas. He's going back for redemption. Looks like we have a pretty hefty hoops run. But again, in this world, it means nothing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven hoops, one prism, and one optic retail. Not the best hoops or pack allocation, but I've seen much better things coming out of hoops than I have some of the other products. Shaquille Brantley, Lopez, and Kuzma. Next week, there are no new products next week, Dirk. Um, because all the manufacturers are starting to get shut down. Panini just announced today that they are closing down. Yeah, he asked about basketball. <clears throat> Flawless football is coming out, but no basketball. That's right. Flawless football is going to be a beast. I'm uh, excited to see if we get any interest on people from Flawless football. Nothing yet, Carson. I'm not seeing any goodies yet. Ooh, it's a high voltage insert. Jude, what are the odds that it's another Jason Tatum? Oh, God. There we go. It's time to open the rest of the pack to talk like Cow oh, Guy. Oh, baby. That's a hit right there. LeBron James. High voltage. High voltage insert. These are worth about 100 smackaroos. 100 smackaroos, cousin. Nice, man. High voltage LeBron. That's what I'm talking about. Such a cool insert card. And to keep our cow guy, Cartman boys, Wilson Chandler, Justin Jackson, and John Collins. Well done, Carson. High voltage LeBron. Congratulations, buddy. I will get my offer like I did earlier to uh, John Bayer. Bayer? I said Bayer because you say it. I am offering up a free basketball gold box if you want to sell that LeBron in trade. That would be the trade offer, Carson. I'm not good at it, Michael. <laughs> Looks like we got an auto too, man. What a redemption box. I told you the hoops packs were going to be good. Cody Martin autograph, <clears throat> followed by a Paul Millsap out of 99. That's too funny. Too funny. Keeping the tradition alive. Did it really, Seabell? Jeez. Might have to throw in a little bit more. Last time I had checked, they were selling around a hundo. DeAndre Hunter, Damian Lillard, Tim Hardaway, and Josh Richardson. <laughs> Last hoops pack. Justin James, Marcus Morris, Marvin Bagley Foyle, Kevin Herter, and Kevin Durant. That's my pet pack, Kenny. Eh? All right. Jalen Brunson, Al Horford, CJ McCollum, and Tim Duncan from your Prism Retail Pack. Your Optic Retail Pack. Optic Retail Pack, Sekou Dumbuya. Avika Zubak, Steph Curry, and a My House John Morant insert. There you go. Pretty solid, my friend. Pretty solid. Get out of here, Seabell. The high voltage? Come on. Kidding me. That's awesome, man. Everybody loves their LeBrons, that's for sure. Carson, I would up the offer. The last base they had sold for $135. Brothers and Co Brothers and Cards Gold Basketball Box and twenty five bucks credit or PayPal. Your call. If not, congratulations because you hit a big one. That's awesome, man. 
Carson, uh, you are up if you want another gold box. It's going to be free plus some money if you want. Or buy another. It could say, I'm waving the white flag. It's your call, Carson. You have the table, my friend. That was a beefcake, big box. That's right. That was a beefcake. <laughs> that big box with a beefcake. Yeah, keep that LeBron. Good for you, man. You're going to buy a Donruss Choice. a boy, Carson. Here's the deal. We got to put you back in the queue, okay? Send payment, but I got to move on to Andy Dickin with the Fantasy Sports Basketball. You always have the table when you're opening the same product. But, well, no, we've got other people in the queue, Andy. So we got to open your box first, and we'll get Carson back on there, all right? Andy Dickin with the Fantasy Sports Basketball. You got to follow the rules, Andy Dickin. Come on, brothers and cards. What did Andrew Marks look like? Um, I don't know. 240. I don't know. Did you label it? No. Andrew Mark, what did you buy for $240? We are opening a brother or brothers. I cannot talk anymore. Fantasy sports basketball. Brothers are not fully accounted for. No. We have two basketball boxes left. Okay, so we have one brothers and cards basketball left. All right. We got you, Andrew Mark. We got you taken care of, man. Excuse me? Oh, okay. All good. Michael, send payment. You'll be getting the last Brothers and Cards boxes in the queue. Andy Dickin for the Fantasy Sports Breaks. Last box mojo, I hope. No graded cards in here. Come on, Dickin. Let's hit one big, buddy. Now he doesn't want it. So, okay, no worries. If you haven't paid, we won't be able to rip it for you. If you've paid, you'll be in the queue for sure. I agree. Hoops is awesome. Hoops is sneaky, sneaky good. I did not know those high voltages have jumped like that. That's amazing. That's really cool. Like I said, the last time I made an offer, it was sale prices of around 100 bucks for one. All right. Revolution Chinese New Year. Past and present. That means I think we're going to have a good single in here, Andy Dickin. 12-13 past and present. First single hit is... Oh, boy. I have a feeling. Just have a feeling. I truly haven't seen the back card. You just got Mr. Steph Curry's dad. Yeah, it's got to be good. Steph Curry's dad, Del Curry, autographics in the front. Anybody want to throw a prediction out there? <laughs> I truly haven't looked at the back. I would just love to see uh, the son pulled after this, right? Father and son box. How nice would that be? Please be right. Please be right. I am right. Yes, Andy Dickin. Yes. No joke. I knew it. I was like, whoever would put a, a Del Curry in there without putting the Sun Spectra award winning Steph Curry auto numbered out of 25. Let's go. Look at that. It's the MVP picture, too. Yeah, baby. Screenshot that. You're on actually. You're actually on YouTube. We'll screenshot it on YouTube. That is a hit. Congratulations. That's number to 25. Let's go. Fantasy basketball. That thing had been sitting there for a little while, waiting for you to have it opened. Addison, you were right. We still have two packs to open. I'm getting so excited about the Steph Auto. Now I'm heated. I'm sorry, Dirk. He had totally bought it, and it was sitting in the queue for a while. And my voice and my brain were just not – they were not working at the same time. And I'm really sorry, Dirk. <laughs> but truly, it was an Andy Dickens box, I promise. All right, we got a Drew Holiday, Blake Griffin, Shaquille O'Neal, Ty Lawson, Bob Cousy, Joe Johnson, Robert Parrish, Larry Bird, and a filler. Nothing big in the old past and present box. <laughs> Andy Dickin, you have a buyer. Aiden wants it. Aiden wants it already. Okay, Chris Middleton. That's your Chinese New Year hit. Not numbered. 
Casey Akpala, Tim Hardaway, Donovan Mitchell, and John Collins. But, ladies and gentlemen, to recap, we got a father and son combo box. That's pretty fun. Congrats, buddy. Well deserved. Well deserved. Steph Curry out of 25. And you have a buyer in Aiden if you want to sell it. Throw that over there for Mr. Andy Dickin. Okay, I think. I think Carson's back in the queue, if I'm not mistaken. No, Andrew Mark. Andrew Mark is in the queue. All right. What other than closing cards? Is this all the same person? This right here is for John Bridges. All that. Yep. That's all John Bridges. <laughs> okay. Andrew Mark, you are up. He bought a uh, Revolution. Andrew, give me a number one through four for Revolution. And number one or number two for your Brothers in Cards Gold Basketball. We are officially sold out of Brothers in Cards Gold Basketball. Carson got the final box. I'm sorry, Michael got the final box. Michael got the final box. So Brothers in Cards Gold Basketball is gone. Revolution's fun. Revolution's probably one of my top three favorite products. Good value for the money. Andrew, number three on Revolution, and First Brothers box. All right. One, two, three. Here's number three, and here's number one right there. Okay. We'll do, let's do the Brothers box first. Here we go. Good luck to Andrew. A friend that's an indie kid, but it, oh, my goodness. There's some beefcakes in here, Andrew. This might be the least hoops box I've seen so far. Carson, you are after uh, you're after Andrew. Watch this, guys. This is Andrew Mark's box. One hoops, two hoops, three hoop. Time for some of the fun. One optic retail, two prism retails, and three optic hobbies out of this Brothers and Cards gold box. Holy moly. Even though Hoops has been good to us, you got some really good beef kicks in here, Andrew. Good luck. Come on, man. Come on, Andrew. Evan, Hassan, Isaiah, Akpala, Mie Oni, Aaron Gordon, John Henson, and Steph Curry. Right, that's the beauty of this program. That's why we love opening it and marketing it for you guys. Severe beefcake. That right there, that's a severe beefcake. Ed Beal, DeAndre Ayton, RJ Barrett, base rookie. Isaiah Roby base, F. Alfonso McKinney, Jeff Green, Kyle Kuzma, and Jamal Murray. I need somebody to look something up for me. How many NBA teams has Jeff Green paid, played for in his career? I mean, I swear it's got to be close to double digits. Jeff Green, how many teams has Jeff Green played for? Hey! How excited are you guys right now? Kaga! Kristen, Alan Krabbe. That's a perfect Cartman name. We pulled an Alan Krabbe and Hassan Wesson. Good thing there's only four cards. I'm so tired, Pat. My voice is shot, man. But I'm having fun. No group PSA subs. No group PSA subs. It's Kai. LeBron, high voltage is really going crazy. I don't know what's going on. Is it really 13, Todd? Get out of here. Hustle Man 2004. I need confirmation on that. Cam Reddish and Steph Curry base. Kyle Jangula says 11. So somebody's wrong. Somebody's wrong. I need legit confirmation here, guys. How many teams has Jeff Green played for in his NBA career? Okay. Come on and be honest with me. Lou Williams, Alfred Payton, 
Keldon Johnson and Jalen Brown. On to your optic hobby packs. Michael says nine. So now I have nine, 11, and 13. That's a lot of NBA teams. There's only 30 teams in the NBA. That means Jeff Green's played for almost a third of the entire NBA in different teams. <laughs> Uh, nothing yet, Andrew. This hasn't, you had the right packs and the wrong players so far. There's two packs left. Come on, man. Come on. You can do this. There's a red. Okay. We got an Isaiah Roby, a red of Marvin Bagley, the third numbered out of 99. The answer is nine. I've got several people now saying nine. So, okay. Jeff Green has played for nine NBA teams. Now, I need you guys to research what's the record for most NBA teams played for by one player. Man, we had so much potential in this box, Andrew, and we just didn't get squat out of it. Man, frustrating. All right, let's do your revolution. See, now, now we got conflicting answers. Now we have 10. Do we count Seattle and Oklahoma City as two different teams, Jake? Nope. Jake says no. He's the judge. Your dreams have been crushed for all of you that said 10. You cannot separate the Thunder and Sonics. It's the same franchise. It's like saying the guys that played for the Oilers when they went over to Tennessee are different franchises. It's the same ownership group. Joe Smith, says Bob Waring. That's not factual, Bob. You have to give me. Four players, Michael says four players have played for 12 different teams. So does Hustle Man. Todd says 12. I'm trying to bounce around between YouTube and Instagram. Oh, come on, Instagram. Don't fail me. Reconnected. We're reconnected. <laughs> Since says Jake sucks. <laughs> so the answer is 12. Are we getting the names? Joe Smith. You were right, Bob. Joe Smith is one. Tony Massenburg, Jim Jackson, and Chucky Brown. Wow. This is fun. Nikhil Alexander Walker, Rookie Revolution. I'm just opening cards for Andrew while I'm just chit chatting about all this NBA stuff. This is nuts. Thank you, Brock. Thank you, Eli. You guys are great. I love it. Pretty fun question, right? Pretty fun question for all you guys to research and get me the answers for. So Jeff Green officially, I'll never forget all this stuff, by the way. Ooh, there's a shockwave LeBron. Sounds like LeBron inserts are where it's at right now, huh, Andrew? There's a nice shockwave insert of LeBron. That's a good card. And hopefully it's like the high voltage that Carson pulled out of his Brothers and Cards box. Um, see you leaving? Yep. See you, Matt. Oh. Oh, you're... <laughs> Tired, man. Oh man. What? No way. I'm I'm flying. Let's do that. That was a lot of fun, guys. That was a lot of fun. All right. Jason Tatum Vortex. Those are cool jerseys. I like the Boston jerseys that have the yellow outline around the letters and numbers. That was a Kevin Durant, actually. I should have. KD Groove. Anybody want to give me a price on that LeBron shockwave insert? Anybody value on that? I hope it's over a hundred bucks for Andrew's sake. It is. It's all in the red so far, Andrew. If I could open it. Man. We did hit a galactic yesterday, Brock. The very last box of the day it had a galactic Shea Gilgis Alexander in it. So it'd be tough to hit us. Oh, there's a good insert too. Supernova. Luka Doncic. Come on, Kyle. There's no way that's a $4 card. Addison says $100. $99.99. Just Newman said $100.01. You are so wrong, Kyle Jangula. So wrong. You pulled a $100 LeBron insert so far, Andrew, so I'd say you're doing pretty well. Miles Bridges. Another LeBron base. Malcolm Brogdon. There's a Rookie Revolution Fractal. Yeah, DeAndre Hunter. It's a nice, decent parallel right there. It's not $4. These guys are talking 100 bucks. You guys are killing me. What is going on? Oh, a base shock wide. 
It is three to four. Benjamin, not? No, it's not. You guys are killing me. I give up. Got a cubic. Oh, man. Malcolm Brogdon cubic numbered out of 50. You are a huge Pacers fan, though, Andrew. That's number 34 of 50. Malcolm Brogdon. Followed by a Tyler Hero base. Last pack. How is how is it that something like a Shockwave LeBron, that's probably just as not rare as a high voltage LeBron, sells for that much cheaper? Yeah, I think it's the base, guys. Andrew, I'm I'm baffled. It is the base Shockwave LeBron. So you guys are saying it's a $4 card now. We went from 100 bucks to a $4 card, Andrew. <laughs> it's not right. I completely duped you on that one. All right. No wonder you're Jake's friend because you're a dream crutcher. Keep throwing out these $1 and $3 price tags. I know. You guys aren't fibbing. I think what you found was a parallel version of it, Jude. Because now Jake's best friend, Pat, is throwing out the old dream crushers at you. Who's next in the queue, Jacob? That's right. Carson's back. Carson is back for the Donruss choice. Good luck, Carson. This is Andrew. And this is Carson. Got that LeBron in there. You might want to take a picture of it if it's selling that well. Okay. Carson's up. <laughs> Pat says he learned from you. Tame his expectations and it keeps him grounded. You kept him grounded. All right, Carson. It's time for a Donruss choice. Give me a number, Carson. One through one through six, bud. One through six. We are ripping a box of Donruss Choice, Spencer, for Carson. Good luck, bud. Is there anybody else in the queue after him? Volovich with the last Brothers and Cards box. Awesome. Yep, Michael Volovich has the uh, last Brothers and Cards gold box. Big basketball, it gone. Big basketball, it gone. Only supposed to be the kind of guy. You're, you're expanding your rules. Here. Sorry. Number five. Okay, this is one, two, three, four, five. All right, good luck, Carson. One box of Donruss choice for Carson Lucas. Time for a banger. Egon. Brothers and Cards basketball boxes. Egon. We ordered 20 this month. We should have ordered 40. My goodness. Okay, here we go. Ooh, there's a blue on top. Does that mean there's a different color in there? Nope, two reds. All right, come on now. Here we go. I think there's some promise in here, Jacob. I really do. I think there's some promise. Okay, here we go, buddy. Cam Johnson, Jordan Poole, Jarrett Culver, my guy, Darius Garland, Matisse Tybel. Zach Levine out of 35. That's number 13 of 35. We've got a Shea Gilgis Alexander out of 99. We have an Isaiah Thomas red out of 99. There is a next day. Carson, cross your fingers, okay? It's a next day, and it's light blue colors. Tells me it's one of two players. I will go nuts if it's who I think it is. There's a Nate Archibald. Here we go. Slow roll. Next day auto. Please be good. Please be good. It's Memphis. It's Memphis. It's either Brandon Clark or John Morant, guys. The next day auto. Oh, come on. One time. Yes. <laughs> oh, it is. Woo, man. Ice, ice, baby. That's our second one that we've pulled since we've been live last week. Carson Lucas for the win. 
Ja Morant next day auto. Yeah, my friend. Yes. Congratulations. Let's get this in the uh, one touch. Man, Carson. You just had a feeling, didn't you, out of the uh, out of the Donruss Choice boxes, didn't you? You had a feeling. Look at that. Look at that. We witnessed greatness. Spalding's cards, you were on here. You wanted to open one. Last one did over a grand. That's what I'm talking about. Are you sure that Pat's not going to say that it was a $4 card? <laughs> Carson Lucas for the win. Guys, that's our second one we've pulled out of our Donruss choice boxes too. How cool is that? Congratulations, Carson. Now can I have the LeBron high voltage or maybe this? Either one, I'll take. <laughs> Super happy for you, buddy. Super happy for you. That is sweet. Freaking $1,000 card. Ja Morant. All right. Now we are talking. That box was not dry. That's right, Sugar. That is right, Sugar Shane. Oh, yep. Carson, you have the table if you want some more. If you would like any more Don Rush Choice. I know, right, man? Whew. That's all right, buddy. You can message me on Instagram. We can talk. It's totally fine. Anything, anything like that. <laughs> See, Bell, that the sale price was $3.95 and a six-piece spicy nugget. <laughs> Oh, man, it's a bottom right corner touch, Jude. So, you know, I'd love to say it's gradable. It's probably a 9 with a 10 auto. The auto is definitely a 10. Um, most of those cards have condition issues because they're so thin and so sensitive being those colored borders. Um, it's, it's probably going to be a 9 with a 10 auto. I'm just predicting it because of the bottom right corner. But, man, that thing's a beast. That's awesome, Carson. I'm super happy for you, buddy. What a hit. Yeah, it's a raw sale. I mean, like I said, if somebody grades it, they're still going to get a mint grade, but it really doesn't change the value too much if it's a nine with a 10 auto. Um, Carson just waved the white flag. We are up for Michael for his our last box. Our last Brothers and Cards gold basketball box. Kind of sad, actually. I'm a little sad. Very cool. Thank you so much, Carson. Congratulations, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Here we go. Michael Volovic. See if we can carry this momentum over. We finished with a bang last night, too. Oh, we're finishing with a bang today. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six hoops, one optic, one Black Friday, and one prism. Last time we had six hoops, we had a LeBron high voltage pulled. So here we go. Good luck, Michael. De'Aaron, Kevin Knox, Serge, Aaron Gordon. I am so jonesing for one of those really rare John ja Morant, Zion Williamson, or Kobe Bryant autos. I would love to see one of those. Man. Is that what they're called? It's just one of those three guys, right? And there's dual versions of them? Oh, gosh. I just want to see one so bad. Kawhi Leonard rode to the finals out of 999. Bad young John Henson. Whew. That was fun. Spalding's Finest has a 9510. Yeah, those are super tough. Corners, I have a 910 already in my investment stash. What a day. Whew. Oh. Coco's got $5.95 and a pepperoni pizza. That beats the $3.95. Uh-oh, we got another signature. Hot signature. There's a hot signature. John Luer. There is nothing hot about a John Luer auto. But it's a hot signature. And yeah, those champ cards sell for big money too, right? Johnny Stockton, KPJ. Miles Bridges. <clears throat> Come on, Michael. Michael. It's not so hot. No, the dual auto is not in choice. I'm talking about hoops. Right here. Hoops basketball has these really rare Art Nouveau autographs that are selling for crazy money. And I don't think we're going to get it. Wait, what's that? 
Oh, that could be an auto. That'd be sweet if that was. Be the autograph. One time. Oh, it's the foil we got next. It's not bad, Michael. Foil we got next of DeAndre Hunter. All right, let's open up our Black Friday pack and hope for an autograph. Oh, that'd be an autograph if there ever was one. There's a cool card. I love that card. Kobe Bryant. It's called the Panini Collection. Followed by a Panini Collection numbered 199, Lionel Messi. Sugar Shane might want to be watching that one. John Luer played for the University of Wisconsin, Jude. And it says he's a hot signature, but it's not. It's a not signature. Yep, Lionel Messi out of 199. Chitty Osman, Jamal Murray, Malik Monk, and Drew Holiday. Last pack for Michael. Come on, Michael. One time. One time Zion. There's a silver in here. Can we finish strong on our last Brothers and Cards gold basketball box? Jokic, Wiggins, D'Angelo. No. Nicholas Batum, silver. Not what we were hoping for. Congratulations, Carson. <laughs> you guys are cracking me up. I think everybody's getting loony now at the end of the day, right? All right, Michael, last box. Anybody else in the queue? I don't think so. The queue is empty. Who wants to open some more product? It's Friday. Our pets' heads are falling off. Breaks tonight. We've got breaks tonight. We've got no food. We got no job. Our pets' heads are falling off. I was hoping for a Zion to Spencer. I was. Anybody else up for some boxes? Hi, Mike. DJ Andy. My soothing voice, there's nothing soothing about my voice. You've heard Jake talk, right? Jake could talk anybody to sleep. Just give him a book and he would read out loud and you could just fall asleep. Our pets' heads are falling off. That's right, Tommy. I still owe you a phone call. I promise to call you. Chain's ready for a 17-18 Topps Chrome UEFA Champions League soccer case. Gee, sugar, haven't you got enough soccer for one, for somebody? It's one of the great. Every line in Dumb and Dumber is one of the greatest lines, Tommy. I quote it all the time. I can't stop. Jake's got the Barry White voice and the nice thumbs. I got the, what somebody call them? I can't remember what they call them. Meat grinder thumbs? Yeah, meat grinder thumbs. High-pitched, annoying voice. Then I sound like Kyle Guy Cartman sometimes. One bourbon, one shot. I'm in. I'm in. I've got it. It's here. <laughs> Jake's voice. You guys need to join the breaks tonight. Buy a box. Buy a spot in the break. Talk about the chef from Muppets. Carson, we have uh, how many spots left in the choice break tonight, Jake? Ten or something. Half full, Carson. Ten spots left. Ten spots filled. The good news is that means it will fill. Bad news is, is it's not done. Oh, the chef from South Park. Seven, left in football, so. <laughs> Seven spots left in the football draft break. Dykus has not texted me yet unless I haven't gotten it. Let me check, Mike. No text from Dykus. Nothing from Gregory. Oh, wow. Coco. Good question. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, okay. I, well, okay. I'll tell you exactly. If, if I truly couldn't get rid of any Jordan, it's not about value. Um, this card right here, Coco, is my first ever card I pulled out of a box. My first ever Jordan card I pulled out of a box. It's not this card specifically. It's the ungraded version. So I have this in my personal safe at home and it's uh, 88, 89 Fleer Michael Jordan. I still have the first ever card I pulled when I was 10 years old. So that card, not this specific one, this is an investment card for long-term. 
for my kids' college, but I have the original of this card from 1988 that I would never part ways with because it's what got me started 31 years ago in collecting basketball and baseball cards. So there you go. That's the story, Coco. I'm sticking to it. Jake is not wearing khakis today, Jude. Jake is wearing a high quarter zip for the Chicago Blackhawks, jeans, and shoes. No khakis. I agree. Jake would be like the best Jim Nance backup, don't you think? Pat, you work for the Parks and Rec. Let's get Jake to do a like a state amateur golf tournament as a test run to see how he sounds. That's cool, Coco. I remember opening that product a lot. <clears throat> well, that's original. <laughs> Good old Dykus. <laughs> Shane, that is an answer to a question that I don't want to ever give. Oh, sugar. Thanks, IndyCards413. Nobody in the queue? Are we done for the day, guys? Are we done? It's been really fun, that's for sure. Started off with ice boxes and it never really calmed down. And then we finished really strong with the old John Morant next day auto from Carson. What a great pull. That was sweet. Pat says you're a good announcer for the Ocho on ESPN. Dodgeball, Dodgeball or um, ping pong soccer where they have to use their heads only. Is there a name for that one? Where they're jumping all over a ping pong table? Yeah. Idiocy, this is called. Oh, gosh. Coco, we have a ton of available. We have stuff that's on our site, on our uh, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter pages. Has the full inventory with pricing. Booger McFarland quotes. <laughs> He's funny. Jimmy Mahan got all my hero graded stuff, Chris B-Ball. Jimmy Mahan got all mine because he's the UK fan. Isn't there, they said a, uh, the Ocho had a Sasquatch screaming competition for like trying to hunt down Sasquatches. <laughs> no joke. Sounds good, Coco. Appreciate it. Booger McFarland. Booger McFarland is the modern day Yogi Berra. Just complete bonehead comments. Bonehead one time comments. Just makes you kind of scratch your head. It's pretty funny. Yeah, I'm sorry, man. Can't help it. I will tell you that AJ's sports cards, he has, oh, there he is right below you, Chris. He has a Tyler Hero next day auto if you're interested in buying that. It was pulled here last week on our breaks. Sounds good, Jude. Just DM Chris B-Ball cards. He's looking for Tyler Hero. No need to get me in there. You guys can connect directly and make a deal. I'm all for it. It's like a virtual trade night. Just use my platform. It is for sale, Chris. Aiden says it's for sale. Aiden, shoot him a message with a picture. No need to get me involved, Jude. I'd let you make the money, man. Buy, sell, and trade. Good luck, Chris and AJ. Hope you guys can make a deal. Oh, I know. I want to so bad, Addison. Aiden wants me to bring him home. He's got a 2 in 10 chance, which is also 1 in 5, but a 2 in 10 chance of pulling one of the other case hits. Man, I would hope so. <laughs> Andy Dickin for the win in YouTube. Andy Dickin throws out a Booger McFarland quote. DeAndre Hopkins was traded to the Cardinals, which means he will no longer be playing for the Texans. <laughs> Can anybody beat that Booger McFarland quote from Andy Dickin? That was good. That was really good. <laughs> hey, guys, anybody want to talk about grading? 
it's time to take a nap then because we are all sitting on so many cards at the stupid grading companies right now so many i don't even want to tell you how many we have you guys might fall out of your chairs seriously you might fall out of your chair it's more than four digits let's put it that way personal cards like just for the shop when you add up everybody with customers included probably talking three or four thousand cards right now sitting at psa waiting to be graded just psa how many beckett's probably another thousand at beckett jake 500 maybe uh, um, stuff, yes. yeah between 500 and a thousand sitting at beckett it's disgusting but deandre hopkins is trained to the cardinals which means he's no longer playing for the texans <laughs> It's sick, Jude. I don't even want to think about it. I have so much stuff. I've bought a few big collections like within the last six months, and a lot of them are sitting at PSA. There ain't a lot of money on the table, and the market's dropping for a little while, so who knows what's going to happen. It's okay. All about positivity, right? Hey, Tommy, are you still on by any chance? Did your guy ever uh, say anything about this guy, the Galactic Steph, PSA 10? It's for sale. It is for sale. For a view, you like to. What else we have? What else do we have? Peyton Manning, Ja Morant, Trey, baseball, baseball. I heard this was a good card. I heard this was a good card, guys. What do you think? Last time I checked, Baby Goat. Baby Goat PSA 10. It's not a bad card, right? It's the Baby Goat. Hey, oh. It's decent, right, Brock? Dece. It's dece. <laughs> yeah, $5 card. I agree, Addison. Sad part is I'd rather have MJ stuff than that card if I had the chance. What do you say, Coco? Anything tickle your fancy before we probably log off? Look at this. This is like Jude's uh, social networking site. Everybody knows Jude. There's a good card too. The math didn't work for me, but for the next ice box, we might have this thing available. It's a silver prism for the next ice box. Stay tuned, people. Stay tuned. We've got that. Could be some banger case hits. Um, we got that. We've got these two silver prisms. What about putting these up for next ice box round? All silver prisms. Trey, De'Aaron, and Ja. That'd be decent, right? All right, Coco, no worries, man. We might save some of these for the next ice box run. All right, my friends, I am going to call it a day. Jake is breaking tonight. Check out exchangercardbreaks.com. We would love to sell out of the break before Jake even goes live. That would be fun. Super, super enjoyed today, guys. It was so much fun. Oh, Dykus already did contact Jake about the case, Mike. He didn't contact me, though. They've been talking. Mm -hmm. Talk to Reese? Yeah. Oh, well, apparently Dykus is going to reach out to you now, too. That was fun, guys. Enjoy the night. Carson, 
for the win today to finish out the day. Carson, DM me if you do have any interest in selling either of those cards because I might want to take you up on those if you want to sell. If not, I'm okay with that and very happy for you. Take care, everybody. Have a wonderful, wonderful evening. It was an absolute blast, and we'll see you next week live and refreshed and ready to go. That was awesome.